Meantime, despite McDonald's announcement that it's raising wages of its hourly employees, union activists are pushing back because they pay the pay increases don't actually apply to all of the restaurants. Jeff Flock live in Chicago talking with some of the protesters there pushing for a $15 minimum wage at McDonald's. One of 15 cities across the country where they say it's a strike. I assure you, you can still get a hamburger at McDonald's, however. It's more of a protest, and perhaps you see it here, that we let you watch as they walk by. Uh, you pointed out, Jackie, that, yes, McDonald's corporately just did increase wages at the restaurants that it owns and operates. Problem is, of course, that that is not uh, most of the restaurants, the McDonald's restaurants in the U.S. By the way, this is a, uh, a big, I guess it's a, a parachute. Can you see that, uh, Jeff? It says nope on it with the uh, Mc McDonald's uh, arches there. At any rate, uh, yes, they've increased wages, but not at the franchisee restaurants. And, of course, that's where most uh, McDonald's are located, in the hands of franchisees. Uh, at the same time, you know, the $15 minimum wage has become more of a talking point these days because you've got a president that supports it and has campaigned on it. And you've got, uh, in addition, a Democratic Congress, which has potentially the power to enact a $15 minimum wage. The problem, of course, is that 15 $15 in a place like Chicago, which, by the way, already has a $15 minimum wage, which will kick in on the 21st of July. Uh, the problem, not so much in Chicago, where $15 is, is a fairly minimum wage, but in places like Montana, West Virginia, out there in the hinterlands, $15 maybe not so much a uh, minimum wage as it is a pretty good wage. As you can see, not a huge protest, but one of 15 around the country as this uh, issue, I think it's fair to say, gets a lot more traction these days with uh, President Biden in the White House and a Democratic Congress. Jackie? It sure does. Jeff Locke, thank you so much for that.